What's up guys? My name is Kuman Bay151 and welcome back to Crops Party. So we are here now. Uh, trying to find another way to go to the other school of building. And right now uh, I'm trying to find another way to go to the other side of building. And it's kind of hard to find it. I'm trying to figure out what to do next. Wait, hold on a second. What the hell? Oh yeah, I remember that. <laughs> I thought I thought there's uh, there's person that are still alive. All right, let's check right here. There's gonna be around here somewhere. No. 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 All right, I think. Nah. There's no longer anyone in the stall. Alright, I better make sure to double check not to miss out anything. No, 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 nothing special around here. Wait, hang on a second. Uh, I better check the items first. Alright, we got it. Naomi cell phone, Seiko cell phone. We don't have a crystal, uh, crystal charm cells thing because we need we need to I need to use this I mean I need to use that thing to unseal this door but it's not working oh yeah I remember uh, we trying to get that sparking purple oh yeah I, I, I almost forgot about that thank goodness there it's still right there there's a purple uh, sparking right there Alright, need to remember where to spot uh, purple. One, two. Alright, I see. I see you staying there, Mr. Sparkling Purple Lights thing ish. Okay. Hang on a second. One, two. Right here. Yep. Alright, stay here. And here we go. Naomi, now. So got it. Okay, it. All right, so we got the key for that room. Heck yeah! The, the room with the red door colors that has a TV inside. In fact, you seem totally unfazed. Do you? figure out what we need to do on your own or something. Actually, I had to do something similar before with Seiko. Do you... Same here, but with Yuka. Let's keep moving. We'll find her. I know we will. Yeah. Alright. I think we found the evidence, guys. We got... Uh, MC... Wait. We got... Uh, what's the name? Like the, the old... Thing? I think HD... HTV, HTV, HB, I think so. Alright. Alright. Finally guys, we got the evidence. Alright. So we're here now. Wait, what the hell? Who turned out the lights? Oh no. Don't tell me there's a murder inside here. Appears. Why is it so cold? Something really smells. And it's pitch black in here. Can you find a light switch anywhere? It's so pretty kind of dark. I can't see. I'll try. No, please don't jump scare. Found it. Alright. Finally. No jump scares. Thank you, game. Thank you. Just give me a chance. Thank you very much. Man, it's this thing in here. And it's not just Molly, is it? Probably not. Uh, that's odd. What's in What is? Oh, nothing. It's like deja vu. I could swear I've seen this room before. Right, hang on. There's uh, it's a old fashioned space here. Something sticky seems to have melted all over its surface. There are stains everywhere. She, uh, there's nothing there inside. 
is a all beat up Kenpo. Right, nothing here. Every day up every day up to November 18, 1975 is crossed off with a big X. Wait, what the hell? What's in what is that sound? Inside the cabinet there is a notebook labeled it night guard logbook and a few complex pieces of paper. Heavily housed elementary confinement what? No talking applications. The sheets of paper contains what appears to be seemingly endless list of names. The lettering is or however making it possible to confirm exactly what's written. Well, that's kinda odd. This play is kinda odd right here. Is the TV still working? We got a evidence though. There's a video eight camcorder laying on the top of the TV. It's cast it's empty. Its batteries also seem to have run out. However, has the LCD display isn't turning on. Or is something this in recent doing in the place of this or maybe it belonging to someone who has brought here like us. Yeah, that doesn't make sense. Unfortunately, there's no cord here to hook it up to the TV and it's out of battery so it doesn't look like we'll be able to get much use out of it. Alright, there's something right here on the note. There's a magazine article here from a publication called Strange But True Stories of the Cult. A cult. It's a follow-up to a previous report. Read it. Alright, let's read it. Strange But True Stories of the uh, Cult is chasing down the hidden paths of the cursed school building, follow up by Ku Kibiki. Let's talk a bit more about Yoshikazu Yanagi School, the love son of Heavenly Host Elementary's principal Takami, Takamai Yanagi Hari. The man was a born instructor, pure and simple. He took up the metal, men, metal as, some, as soon as he could and Perform his duties and with peerless pain. But then the illness streak struck, and little by little, his winning personality gave way to pure instincts. He was slowly losing all sense of identity. Although the cause of this illness was unknown, it, its effects were anything but simply put, the good teacher had begun reverting to a childlike state. He began carrying a etiquette doll with him at all times, a memento from a long forgotten festival perhaps given to him by his late mother. His behavior during class regarded quickly more often than nothing. His lectures would tease case before the period's end, and he began begin wailing Finally several months prior to the kidnapping and murder incident. Yoshikazu reached a point where he could no longer, where he could no longer communicate his thoughts. Also, he could still understand others. He became virtually incapable of forming words without intense focus. Given all the evidence not against him, Yoshikazu Naga Yanagi Hori was arrested on multiple counts of kidnapping, murder, and this great of the dead. But due to his mental condition, he was never able to confess his involvement in these crimes, not even properly discuss them with authorities. Everything he on the dis testimony of the Saw survivor, one Sashiko Shinozaki, H7, in search of the truth behind the less scientific fictions, this incident spurred one of course choose to follow the trail of this mysterious little girl. Those who have seen the infamous newspaper photos in company this story may remember Shashiko best as the girl with the strikingly unusual red dress. Oh, so th the girl with the red dress that we met last, last, last met. It's hard not to feel sympathy for someone so young forced to watch other children of her age being tortured and killed one by one. And certainly if I were to find Miss Shinozaki and secure an interview, there won't be some real moral concerns about digging up such painful memories. 
but then again she's been a full gold and hopefully well a adjusted adult for over 10 years at this point but now she won't she should prob she should be able to look back upon these horrific events with some objectivity and give a more true account of what happened to that day oh boy wait so we're here now it's still the same we're we're in a different dimension not same goes to naomi and sayuri i mean santoshi sorry my bad i was scared out of my mind my brain is still struggling to make sense of all this okay but look the ghost is gone i guess we really managed to this All right. Wait, she's okay. You should probably dry your tears and blow your nose at least. Wait, what the hell is she doing? I didn't tell you before that you shouldn't say things like that. Who are you? Too? Uh, that's really gross. Not good. She's not normally like this. Wait, hang on. Oh no, don't tell me she's about to possess her uh, by the ghost. Right. We finally got the evidence, guys. We finally go inside the... The room with the red door. Finally! Alright, we'll stop it here, guys. And this might be the end of chapter 4 and moving on to chapter 5. I don't know, I think it's still... Uh, more mysterious stuff going on uh, in the next video so yeah I'll end this right here uh, I'll, I'll do the next videos for you guys like and subscribe if you enjoy and uh, yeah that's pretty much it for today guys I'll see you guys in the next videos as always stay cool guys goodbye